This week on Clown College. Josh. Are you a big handy guy? <laughs> <laughs> I love them. You'd like them too? I mean, they're all right. Ah. What are you, are the, you into them? Fuck no. Okay. Don't try to give me a hand job. I can jack myself off. Now, head. I mean, to start it off, and you and like you just kind of like imagine if your two are like sitting. I don't. But I'm you talking about hard, hand but... job until completion. <laughs> no, no, no. no. <laughs> I don't want you to ever say those words again. <laughs> I don't want you to ever say those out that loud. Sounds like a charge. <laughs> hand job to completion. Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> you know, high treason. Hand job to completion. That should be illegal, dude. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> That nobody was operating under that assumption. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Clown College Podcast. We're just a couple open micers trying to make our way through the scene. Where we interview comedians throughout different stages of their comedy career, no matter if they're open micers, headliners, or traveling comedians. I'm here too, Jamie 2.0. I just talk a lot more. Damn it, Brandon. Go sit in the corner. Welcome back to Clown College. What's going on? Howdy. We want to say thank you for tuning in. I mean... Oh, yeah. The the feedback's been great. Yeah. A lot of love and support out there. Thank you guys for sharing our stuff, being interested in coming on, and just watching the podcast, man. It means a lot. Hell, yeah. I mean, we were expecting like 10 views max. Yeah. Um, single digit. Yeah, I, I, I was expecting nobody. Who the, who, but realistically, who the fuck would want to watch an hour of some random people talking yeah. that yeah. they don't know? Well, we appreciate it. <laughs> we appreciate it. Thank you it. for listening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they just watch for our bomb jokes. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, there's going to be some <laughs> bomb ones today. <laughs> <laughs> I can guarantee you that. Uh, so what happened? How was Thanksgiving? It was good, man. It was good. Family came to town. I met four of my new Mexican brothers. That was that was fun. They speak a little bit of English. Just a little bit. We communicated well, though. But shit's crazy, man. Shit's, shit was weird, but it was good, though. Discipline kids. I think my bomb's beating the fuck out of them, to be honest. <laughs> they were on their P's and Q's the whole time, dude. <laughs> Straightened up. They knew to mm-hmm. shut up during the blessing, yeah. dude. I, I, I love it. You know, sometimes you got to beat these kids. And I oh, think hell it's a, yeah. I think that's a lost art. I agree. Yeah, Brandon, just a good pop. Brandon knows all about oh, that. Oh, yes, man. Brandon does know all about <laughs> that. You know how many ass whoopings I took? A lot. Yeah, a lot, man. <laughs> my look at me. I'm very professional ass. now. No, no I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, how was your Thanksgiving, man? Man, it was it was good. I'm not gonna lie. Got too stuffed though. Got too stuffed. Got too high. Lost a lot of money. All that. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> How'd you lose the money? Oh, you know, you know, you get paid. <laughs> shit, shit just hit you. Gas came out of nowhere. I saw some cool shit I wanted. I <laughs> got hungry. Brandon, gas does not come out of nowhere. <laughs> There's a meter in your car that tells you exactly how much gas you have. <laughs> that shit don't sneak up on you. Dude, I feel like I went around the corner. <laughs> Apparently, I went around the whole city. Nah, I got no It's because one turn takes you. <laughs> I know. Yes, dude. He's seen me One drive. gallon of gas. I'm very careful, man. Take me. Like, oh, you think I'm 80 years old. And I talk about people driving horrible, but look at my ass. I'm slow as shit. <laughs> uh, I love hearing you and your fiance <laughs> yep. argue about driving. Mm-hmm. Because every time at uh, Straight to AO, me and Brandon park in oh, the yeah, back always. in the same spot, basically. Uh-huh. <laughs> And when I'm walking back, they're always a few steps behind me, and I can hear her going, I keep telling you not to park back here. It's weird. <laughs> there's there's homeless people around. Yep, I'm like, there's so many cars up front, I don't want to hit a That's sidewalk. True. Wink, wink, you know. <laughs> That's why I say when I hit something that not supposed to hit. That parking so, lot is confusing. Some tells me Brandon's been in a lot of hit and runs with that comment right there. Yeah, yeah <laughs> he maybe. He said sidewalk and put up yeah, quotation marks. Hit a school <laughs> trash can once, scared everybody. It's still there. You go to... You go to the school I go to. I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> you look at the trash can. You go, you're going to see it. It's fucked up. Yo, man. This is crazy. You remember that trash can, man? It's really still here. Like, this is what I did. I fucked this shit up. Damn. Is it like a dumpster? Oh, no. It's like one of those, like, what, what, is, what is that? Those red, like, you know, the, the metal ones. I hit like a metal one. A dumpster. No, not a dumpster. The, the small trash can. You know the little small ones that are like near the parking lot when you park, and they got like a little <laughs> one you could go to. You know what I'm yeah, talking yeah, about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You talking about like the round ones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. those round. Oh, ones. Yeah, not the dumpster. Saying. That shit. I, thought, I don't, dude. Would it be weird to consider like having two guests in one episode? Like, no, no, no. like no. if we did our pre part before, like we just had somebody sitting there and they watched our clips with us, and then the interview part is with a different guest. 
Would that be weird? So, so I don't think it would be weird. I think the only thing is, is that it'll be like we can have the open micers before, do, and then the comedian, with, then like the, the long term, then the long term, because okay. because then we'll be able to get open micers, and then we'll be able to still get them their own episode. Yeah, because this, you know, it wouldn't be centered around them. They're just talking and bullshit with a, with us, and then you know, right, like that. right. I think I think that's a good idea. Cause that'd be fun, man. Yeah. Cause oh, like, yeah. uh, I, I, I've been wanting Charlie on here. That's what that is exactly. Is that what how you think about? I fucking yeah. I love Charlie. Well, Jake, well, Jake was already on it. Right. I think yeah. Jake's funny as hell. And oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah, he covered for me last week, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good shit, Jake. Appreciate it, man. Oh yeah, thank you, dude. Like, like, dude, it was literally I last like, second, like thirty, I'm, maybe not even thirty minutes, because Nico yeah. was already on his way. Yeah, and I was like, I just looked at him. I was like, so which one of you guys want to co-host? <laughs> <laughs> I had a family emergency. That's the reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I missed you guys, man. I, I love doing this shit. It's, it's fun. fun. That's fun. Oh, it's, it's a great fun time. as hell, man. Come on, dude. I love seeing Dom in his, like, soft purple hoodies. <laughs> See that? That yeah. shit's nice, though. Hell, yeah. They, they told me I had to wear more earth tones. Or maybe That's, Allison. What is fucking the, earth Alli- are you living in? I know. In? I know Allison said it, but I can't remember what the tone was. But it was, like, green. and Earth, earth tones, yeah. Forest green. green. Yeah, dude. Yeah. My HGTV joke. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Earth tones. She wanted to go with fucking. I can't even remember my own joke. The tan one. Autumn brass. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> I like that's like the on the Valspar paint sheet. I went to Home Depot and I was looking at those and I was like, I should put this as a tag. I think it, nobody ever laughs, but I think it's funny, so I'm keeping it in. Fuck you, dude. I'm telling you, I'll do that joke that nobody ever laughs about. My uh, my. I mean, it's rough. It's rough. I don't even want to yeah. tell you what it is because it's so rough because it, it's be out of context. Is it the... The suck the gas. Yeah. <laughs> but let the gas out of lungs. Uh, I'll let you know what kind of people. Oh. I don't want to pull Kanye in here. But <laughs> no. <laughs> Third Kanye shout out in a, wor- in a row. Three weeks in a row. I, and I, I want you guys to know, I actually do believe he's in, he's, he's insane, but like creative insane. He has yeah. to be. He's like evil genius, dude. Yeah, yeah. Full like, on oh, evil but genius. See, 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 genius, though, I'll bite back on this. I think they give genius to too many people. Yeah. If you can make music, I don't, I'm, I'm not saying. I guess there. I guess you can be a musical genius. I think so. Like, if you yeah. listen to some like songs, yeah. it's a different level. Like, you just un- understand like universally, more people are gonna fuck with that song just because it's good. Mm-hmm. There's a I'll, lot of artists. I'll give you one. Like when they're they're like uh, maybe like a YouTube guy or like he's a, like Mr. Beast. Like he's a genius. I don't believe he's a genius. I think he's more of a hard worker. Yeah. Exactly. Very disciplined. It's hard working good man like Rocky, you know what I mean? He, like, yeah, he's re- he's a really good dude. He mm-hmm. does a lot of like he does like charitable why, shit. Why do people hate on uh this guy when he does that? I see that all the time on Twitter. Uh, well, I think it's kind of like a double-edged sword cuz at the end of the day he is making content. Yeah. He's he, making money off of it, but okay, he's making money and then giving at least giving doing something. I think he gives like the vast majority of it away or at least nah, reinvest it into the videos. Yeah. Like he he'll he's that Squid Game video mm-hmm. he made. I think he spent like three million dollars to make that, wow. which is insane. Who else is doing that? No, like okay. social media wise. No, I, think, I, I don't watch. I mean, I never watch one Mr. Beast video. I have not. I don't know anything about them. They're entertaining, but, but yeah. uh, I always see them. Every time I see them, it's like he's doing something good, like building whales or some shit. And they well, people will hate on anything. Yeah, bro. I'm like, oh, yeah. like hate he, on the guy that's doing. Something. Didn't he like pay for that surgery overseas for people to get their sight back? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah like, like a thousand people. people. Yeah, and people he hated do on it over that. there. Why couldn't he do it over oh, here? Because here you got to pay like infinitely more for yeah. it. Well, actually, I think it's like a pretty simple procedure. They just don't really have like the medical infrastructure over mm. there. They don't got the doctors and hospitals. I guess. I don't oh, fucking okay, know. okay. I like I said, I am a licensed <laughs> physician. I'm an MD. I know what I'm talking about, dude. <laughs> we all are, Brandon. Uh, you were first in your class, weren't you? With what? <laughs> Say it again. No, no, I need you to tell me this again. Tell hey, me. D- <laughs> grab, <laughs> grab your <laughs> helmet. You said everything we needed to know right there. <laughs> okay. Yeah, because I was hearing you said MD. Did yeah. you get good you know grades what? in school, Brandon? I'm not trying to put you on blast. I know. I'm I know curious. you're not. Uh, I did, Brandon. Don't worry about it. Then you know what? We, me and, uh, we, we didn't. Me and mm-hmm. Dom, I remember, man, we, we, we didn't. What? <laughs> first of all, I yeah. didn't. <laughs> Y'all went to school in two different eras. Yeah. I know, right? Man, I, yeah. We didn't have cell phones when I went to high school. Yeah, right? true that. We true. had little flip ones. Yeah, right? now we got phones, vapes, and shit. Whatever you know, vapes. all the. Women right, have you shit. seen those new vapes that you buy it and it comes with its own lanyard and people wear what? it around really? their neck? I swear this is real. I think they're called Raz. I don't vape, so I don't uh, know, but it's like a nicotine vape and it comes with its own lanyard. 
And it's like part of the culture, dude. Nah. It's the new drip. If you're like 15, that's the coolest shit to do right now. 15 year olds are doing it. I mean, I was. I was I was I was smoking black and miles at fifteen. Oh, also I knew that I I found that out because of like a thirty eight year old woman. I, I drove uh, past Decatur like almost to Rogersville because mm-hmm. uh, I'm talking to this girl and she has a horse. Uh, I, I posted the horse picture on my Instagram. Oh yeah, I saw that. Man. I had to recreate the video. Hey, if you seen if you haven't seen the horse video on Twitter, we'll link it. Play it now, Brandon. Yeah, yeah. All right, hold up, y'all. But <laughs> well, it's the exact no. same horse. But we pony. drove out there and we stopped at McDonald's, bro, because I've been craving McDonald's yeah. breakfast. I haven't had it in so long. You were saying that. Yeah, Shit, that it McGriddle. Go, the McGriddle, dude. Hell yeah. American wow. culinary ingenuity, bro. Yes. That's a Perfect. fucking yeah. dude. You remember that Which chicken I was telling you about? Bacon, egg, and cheese. Bacon, egg, I didn't try the chicken oh, one. I was too scared to order it, dude. I'm not good at the like secret menu. That show. crispy chicken one? But I put egg on it. Oh, you put the egg on the crispy chicken? I, yeah, hell yeah. Oh, wow. Get, on the McGriddle, if I'm getting the McGriddle on there and, and chicken, I want egg on there, and then I want uh, like some syrup to put on it. Like, like, I fuck mm-hmm. with it. I'm like, I got to try I like that jelly. Thing. I like putting jelly on breakfast sandwiches. Yes. But we were driving out there, and we stopped at McDonald's to get it, and there was this lady with like four total teeth in the drive-thru that had one of them. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. Like, I just wanted to ask her questions about it. I'm uh-huh. like, what the fuck? This is like beyond a lighter leash. This is true addiction. Yeah. Wow. It's like a security thing for your vape. That way you don't lose it and freak out. <laughs> People flip their fucking top when they lose their vape. Hey, angle I've seen line. it first. Oh, yeah. Me too. Yeah. I've seen that. I shit. lose all respect for you if you do that, by the way. <laughs> Not that my respect means much, but you do lose yeah. it. If I see you do some crazy shit like that, calm yeah. down, man. <laughs> it's always, dude, smoke cigarettes. Exactly. Yeah, honestly. I tried to stop and I was vaping. <laughs> when I met, whenever, it's JJ, I told JJ the, that. But. Whatever you're about to say, you've smoked cigarettes since the first time I ever. I met know, you. but I always quitting back then <laughs> when I was smoking. I would only borrow from people for a month, and then uh, shout out Clint. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> he gave Clint. you 17 Newport. Clint's the bartender at uh, Black Panther Hidden Dragons. Shout open out mic, Newport. Box car. He all he all treat he always treats you right. Fast service gives you cigarettes if you need them. Hey. And, he and he stands on business. Yeah. Oh yeah. He'll throw your ass out of there. We've seen it. Oh yeah, yeah true that. He so something that one dude like slapped his boy, and then he Clint had to put him in a full. I just seen him put him. Me and Jack <laughs> looking at him. He put him in a full nest and I'm dragging him out. Yeah, dude. Oh shit. So the, speaking of the box car, we were up there last Sunday. Now we haven't did it. I, you only you did the Michael Cannonball on Monday, right? Yeah, this so past it's, Monday. right now it's been like almost a week since yeah. we've done comedy, which sucks. But uh, Thanksgiving break, yeah, yeah, Thanksgiving break though. You know, what I'm saying had to get something good to eat, and uh, so we were up there. And after the mic was over, it was like he was black, but he kind he was light skinned and kind of looked Egyptian a little bit, and he had the fucking thing over his head, like uh, not like a uh, religious one, but just had the uh, like Erica Badu <laughs> shit on his head. Oh, and I he know ca- what you mean. And he came in there, and it's like it's like Jalen sitting right here, Alex Z sitting right here, and then me right here in Sci-Fi. And he comes up right between the middle of Jalen and Alex and, like, puts his face right by Jalen's. So I'm thinking that they know this guy. So I'm like, and I see I see the way uh, Alex looks over, like, you know how Alex is. He was like, yeah. what the fuck? And then Jalen, like, looks at him. He's like, oh, I know you. I know you. But you could tell he don't know him. And, you know, Jalen's the nicest guy in the world. So he's like, yeah, man. Uh. <laughs> but you can tell he's getting irritated. And he keeps on coming over there like he's clearly on some type of drugs. He's like, I'm worth a billion dollars. Y'all got me fucked up. I'm worth a billion dollars. He walks outside. We start talking about it. He comes back in and he's like, don't throw stones at glass houses. But he's not talking to anybody. He's like just talking to the air. You know how they are when they on drugs? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. He's tweaking. Yeah. Oh, tweaking hard. That's I was about crazy. to I, I was about to have to put him Clint down. Didn't, <laughs> Damn. I believe you, dude. Clint no, didn't throw him out. Clint, Clint was hip to it. He was like, I don't know what that dude's on. Because he would leave and then come back. And then mm. leave and come back. He'd be like, oh, y'all, y'all, y'all funny, y'all funny. And so he must have maybe seen Jalen there before or something like that because he was the only one he was talking to. And then he kind of, kind of tried to take the seat and come sit with us. I'm like, dude, who the fuck is this guy? Yeah. Wow. But I wanted to tell you this about the boxcar too when we were out there. So Sci-Fi did a joke. And, you know, he's up there. He was like, I wonder if – Muhammad was was fucking, you know what I mean? Ooh, wow. <laughs> so, okay, that's so, a thought. Dude. So, so he's he's like, you think about it. he was a, he was a real, he was like he was saying he was a real guy. So was he fucking? You know, he was a real yeah. dude. And so he was like, you got to think of what he looks like. Dom, stand up. <laughs> so it's hilarious. I get up, I play along, and I just think it's funny. And this dude, 
I don't know if you were there the last time, but he was there before. Tall, tall white dude, the one I said like machine gun Kelly type. Oh, same, okay. same dude comes up and massages my shoulder. So as Char- Charlie was sitting oh, right there, damn. this is the second time. Yeah, I was What's going on around here? Yeah, I think it's the Brandon effect, what dude. The fuck? <laughs> you start getting touched you when Brandon shit is yeah. happening to you now, man. You've been hanging with me too long. This motherfucker like got a curse. <laughs> oh shit! Like King Touch. The curse no, of they Brandon. Touch your butt. <laughs> Damn, dude. <laughs> what the, what the fuck? fuck? He just <laughs> did. You just bust a rhyme? He just busted a rhyme oh, without molestation. <laughs> Doctor Seuss style in this bitch. Drop. <laughs> you hate Jews? Uh, no, no, I love Jews. Yeah. They're good people. I, that's I what Doctor Seuss style is. Fuck yeah. Doctor Seuss. I, I realize that's a racist bastard. You're right. I was seen a lot of it was a different time. Yeah, you're right, man. Whatever. <laughs> fuck it. You good? Man. No. <laughs> is that easy to change, Brad? Like, nah, nah, fuck it. He's, he's a good guy. He was just a Nazi. Yeah. But, um, so the hat goes hard. So he comes up oh, and yeah. rubs on my shoulder and lightly whispers in my ear, "You know, you got to get him back, right?" And then I'm like, I look at Charlie. I'm like, did he just rub my shoulder? He's like, yeah, bro. Oh, I'm like, what is going on? I'm just thinking about the last time this shit happened. Somebody grabbed my hips. And then now <laughs> somebody's grabbing my shoulder, <laughs> massaging my shoulders. He's like, you got to get them back. He's masseusing you, bro. But well, yeah, well, he was right. So I was like, I had to start writing jokes. <laughs> so You so- need it. I needed him to, I needed, I needed the, I wasn't even thinking about roasting sci-fi. I'm not going to lie to you. I didn't tell sci-fi. I told sci-fi he was rubbing my shoulder. No, nah, there was another time at Boxcar where you could have used his motivation. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, Jay. And fuck that little short ass nigga. <laughs> 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 fuck he talk about. Nah, just What's his name, I dog? Know, I don't know who that nigga is. Shit, he don't know me. I don't know you, play What? <laughs> but, uh. But look, <laughs> I'm bad. JJ I'm gets a kick out of this shit. Every time, if if I even say something about a short person, J, oh J, JJ's like, oh, he's talking about this motherfucker. <laughs> he gets a little. That, is, that just inspired your comedy career has skyrocketed since that moment, like measurably. I had to. That was a teaching moment. You know, somebody you just need those. Dude. Somebody yeah. roasted me on stage, and not really roasted me, but just it was even worse. Than a, it was it was worse than a roast. Because he's like who whoever that other guy is, and so it's like it's the ultimate diss. I'm uh, even though I only met, I'm only seen him twice or something like that. Yeah. So he probably legit doesn't know who I am, and I don't care. But I did care. He didn't like you before. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. uh, I did. I did. I didn't. <laughs> I'm beyond. No, I didn't. I didn't dislike him. I didn't think he was funny. Oh, true. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Look yeah. at me instigating shit, dude. Yeah. Shame on me. We're gonna keep bro. all oh, this in, short motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Come on the podcast when you get back yeah, from no, no. the war. That for you sure, for sure. Yeah, he has he has good jokes, dude. Yeah. I, well, I saw him win Rocket Republic one time. He had a good set. Dude. He he he, uh, he all won. black room. Yeah, did he? Yeah. Okay. He might. He he he's probably good. I'm just saying the time I see him, he went. But uh. <laughs> What I'm trying to get We're getting to. getting in trouble for this one, dude. <laughs> for who? What the fuck you think? I, what is he gonna do? Damn. <laughs> Damn! I mean, you bite right. my ankles. Ain't gonna do <laughs> shit. <laughs> Fuck this little nigga go do it. Trust me, JJ. You you don't have to be worried about him when you can hold their head like right. this <laughs> and they just scream it. Dude, on. he knows jujitsu. I don't give a <laughs> fuck. He could be horse gracie now. <laughs> I'll pick this little motherfucker up by his neck. Oh, wait, nah. what's his I really don't have a problem with. I want to. I want to be be clear. Yeah, I, really I, I think he's funny. Yeah, yeah. Thank JJ, JJ thinks you're funny. It was. But, <laughs> He Brandon might be. Mike. I've only seen him twice. You. I've only seen him twice. He might be. You know what I mean? But uh, <laughs> <laughs> we're definitely gonna have more. If it comes back down. Of course, dude. Yeah. We want you on. Hell yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. It'd be funny. He probably he's probably a cool guy. You know. But uh, anyway, so so he says that, and I'm like, I gotta write some jokes, bro. Yeah. So I was like, I'm gonna write. I'm gonna write two for sci-fi. So I get up on stage. I wrote two of them. I get up on stage. I'm like. I'm like, thanks, guys. I'm like, give it up for Sai, because he killed, like, he yeah. murdered. I bet he did. Oh, oh yeah. always he, does. Yeah, yeah, but he, like, you know, for, like, a couple, he wasn't getting the responses he wanted from the crowd. Yeah. Material's always good, but then this time, he, like, he, you could, even when he when he got off, he was bouncing around more and <laughs> shit like that. Like, he killed. So I was like, give it up for Sci-Fi. Didn't he kill it today? Everybody start clapping. I'm like, yeah, he's he's good, man. He's good. He's good for somebody who looks like the predator that only fished. <laughs> like, his, own, his only prey was bluegill. Oh, my God. <laughs> and, and then, <laughs> it's 
I fly from New York, dude. No, I'm talking about the predator because it got to drain. Oh yeah, I know, but there's he, no way he can fish. Dude. No, no, probably oh, yeah. not. But it's the, it's the joke I know, about yeah, his I fat. Know what you mean. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, so then, so then I'm like, uh, I pause for a second. I'm like, he looks like Bob Marley without the metabolism. <laughs> <laughs> and people like it. No, that set the, the the first one went over like okay, but then that one uh set it off and he was laughing. It was it was yeah. a good time. But yeah, his ass got me. I had to get motivation from somebody to rub my shoulders. I'm not gonna lie, it worked. Yeah. Thanks. Man, that's, your, that's your origin story, yeah. man. <laughs> so what else is going on? We got some. Oh, this will already this will already be done. But Treehouse Comedy Showcase, 8 p.m. at Shenanigans, December 1st, and then 4th of December, 4th of July, and December, hosted by Carson Elmore. Carson Elmore at the shop right here. Uh, it's gonna be a fun time. It's like veterans get in free. Everybody else has to pay four bucks, four think, bucks yeah. or something like that, and it's a it's a all it's a goes banger towards uh, some veterans association. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot which one. My mm-hmm. apologies. Yeah, the vets need it. I'm yeah. Telling you with this health care they got going around, I feel like I got to <laughs> yeah. bribe the, the VA fucking stuff? yeah. I got to yeah. bribe my doctor to get me eczema cream. Ain't that a bitch? Yeah, that's crazy. Damn, man. Just give me the shit. Yeah, tropical. It's a tropical steroid. Tropical steroid? Is it topical or tropical? It's definitely topical, dude. Topical? Why the fuck would it be tropical? What, you know what? Hawaiian punch? <laughs> yeah, I've been saying that wrong for a long time. <laughs> tropical. tropical steroids, dude. What? I've been saying that long for a while. Like steroids, you and Jack. They're going to get Jack and start <laughs> speaking like a Jamaican. Tropical steroids, man. <laughs> Fucking slow. Oh my god. Uh, me and words, man. And it's crazy. I'm doing a thing where I have to talk. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm way. trying to do. I'm trying as to long do. as you don't have to talk for too long. Yeah, yeah. You can get yeah. away with five minutes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I can get. T- I, I think I can do. I can do. I can do ten right now. It would be shaky. I will be doing that joke that never works, but <laughs> that would be in there. The broke like joke. Half my material. Yeah. yeah. The, bro- <laughs> the jokes that don't work. Yeah. <clears throat> And the joke, I swear, it's always the jokes that you think, that you think are throwaways. Yeah, people like all those lines, and you're like, "Why the fuck? Everybody's laughing at that shit." Dude, I'm just waiting for the day that I write a joke that I'm proud of and I think is funny, and then other people also find it funny. The other, the only ones that I tell right now that get like good laughs or shit, where I was like, mm, "I'll just try this out." Mm-hmm. I was never confident in them, and then people laugh, and I was like, "What the fuck, dude? dude you're shit preaching sucks. to the choir, man." <laughs> like, dude, <laughs> it's like I'd be like, "No, that ain't going." Then somebody's like, "Just do it, man." I'd be like, "Fine, I'll go try it," and then I'm like, "Oh shit." That was good. What the fuck? Hey, Speaking okay. of bad jokes, let's watch the clips. <laughs> Clip of the week. Or teacher, or a guy named Dennis who gives you candy and goes to your mom's room. That was just me, man. That was just me. But, uh. The gears are. But, uh. Crash the burning, baby. I just literally just forgot. Fuck it, I forgot my whole house. I'm done with it now, all right? I can't make it. Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck else am I just going to talk about? I'm, I'm probably about done anyway, right? Yeah. Nico did minute. not save you. He's like, one more yeah. minute. Right? I got everything, though. I don't have my phone. I don't even have my phone on me. All right, guys, I'm Don Carr. Welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you fucking bomb, baby. Oh my gosh, dude. That hey, was that's not, a great clip, dude. Not one sentence made sense. <laughs> <laughs> that's I about forget. time, isn't it, Nico? He's like, you have 60 seconds. <laughs> it's gonna feel like forever. Oh yeah. It'll <laughs> feel like two decades. I tried to think of another I couldn't think of the joke I planned to do. Damn sure couldn't think of another joke that yeah. I had. I was completely. Well, once you forget right the there. plan, bro, and you didn't mm-hmm. plan to improvise, yeah. it's like okay. It was I'm like fine. I'm doing my set for this show. Yeah. I'll do it. It's like, I can't even remember the next joke. I don't even know what it is at all. <laughs> yeah. I don't know the punchline. I don't know the setup. I don't no. know any of the tags. It might not even exist mm-hmm. anymore, dude. I fucking forgot it permanently. <laughs> I'm preaching to the choir. But dude, because my memory is just fucking horrible. That, I had to pick that clip, dude. It's a growth moment. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a learning moment. I love it. Shit happens to me like once every other open mic. <laughs> <laughs> I, I forget some part of the joke. Oh, yeah. On Monday, I forgot my closer. It was like I was telling a joke about three unfortunate truths or whatever, mm-hmm. and I only said two of them. And I had like plenty of time to finish the joke. I just fucking forgot. 
It happens, dude. It happens, yeah. dude. It happens. It's I mean, it's, it's a hard game. Yeah. This comedy shit ain't ain't, ain't it's easy. It's hard for us. Yeah. It's hard, <laughs> it's hard for people like us. Yeah. yeah. And JJ don't remember shit. I do. I can't remember Same. anything, bro. Yeah. First of all, I'm a I'm a, I'm a cut. I'm have to go back, but I'm a, probably have to cut it out when he said you said the same story. You tried to do this twice. On the last <laughs> episode, you were telling a story. I, I cut it out, and you were like, uh, I was like, yeah, you told that last episode. You were like, oh, man. <laughs> and then this <laughs> time, you just told the whole story again. It just means they're good stories. Yeah, yeah They're they memorable. Good. Great stories. But I can't right. remember. <laughs> All right. Let's see this one. All right. This son of a bitch right here. <laughs> Go. He's playing all the geriatric classics. We got the Weather Channel, The Price is Right, Wheel of Fortune, and my personal favorite, HGTV. Now, I'm very passionate about home and garden television, and I'm not afraid to say that. You know, that program tickles my fancy. I like it. <laughs> and uh, it took me a little while to get into it. I didn't get it at first, but about three episodes in to flip that house, it clicked, right? <laughs> I started saying shit like, did Carol really go with the glass tile backsplash over the Calicotta marble? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, what a fucking catastrophe that is. You said you were going for Southern Rustic. That's giving more strip club kitchenette, but it's your house. <laughs> Damn, I'm pulling a dome for you. <laughs> <laughs> See, I got the biggest pop of my entire shit. Hey, strip club, kitchenette at your house. Okay, all I'm saying is this. <laughs> hey, hey, you hear people in the background go, oh. <laughs> and then you hear Brandon at the end just saying, damn. <laughs> no, that's my weird response for everything. Just, damn. I think it's just a very deep instinct in the human yeah. psyche. Mm -hmm. If you are failing, throw somebody else under the of bus. Of course. Too. Yeah. And you know, Save yourself. And you, you want to know if I was mad about that? <laughs> no, but I was mad about him asking if I was mad about that. <laughs> I was like, Dom, you, you're okay, right? I know you're the sensitive type. Yeah, so. <laughs> me? <laughs> Out of everybody think I give a fuck? You can say whatever you he want got, about Dude, me. you should have seen his face. We were sitting at the uh, at the can of bar, at the bar. Shout out, Matt, dude. Mm -hmm. and Shout out. <laughs> Dom turned around and he was like, he looked like I had just said I shot his mom in the face, dude. He was so pissed. But I had to ask, dude. No. Oh. Never ask again. I, I never Nothing, will. Nothing's dude. gonna. Yeah. We. Oh. We know. We never did a roast battle. Have you ever been? Have you been invited to one? Mm -mm, I don't think they so. They have them here. You know that, right? No. Ty Funny was telling me about it, and they have one like in December something. I want to go watch it. I never. Me too. I never mm -hmm. see like promo for those. Who doesn't? I mean, I've never seen one, but he was just telling me they have one, like they, they're going to dress up as different people, and then you write roles for, like saying you're Benjamin Franklin. You know, they're going to have a list mm. of people, and they write roles for the person, like uh, the person they're imitating. Oh, got you. That's shenanigans, I believe. Shout huh. out, shenanigans. Hell yeah. Shout out. Kim. Jessica. Kim, Jessica, always treating us right. The Ripper. You go up there and get that. <laughs> Beast of a Jimmy Jam, I call them. Y'all call them Glizzies. Call? Glizzies, yeah, yeah. yeah people call <laughs> yep, them Glizzies. glizzies. Yeah, uh, yeah. Them hot dogs, yeah. man. Them big Four Locos. Mm -hmm. You got all kind oh, of beer. Oh, dude. The Four Loco. That's, I love that's it. That's a young people's dream. I love it, dude. <laughs> $7, be drunk for three hours. Can't beat that, dude. <laughs> you can't beat it. Can't beat it. It Are will explode like your heart, though. I think some of it depends on the flavor. See when they first do you were you drinking when they first came out? There's no I wasn't way. alive when they first came out. Are you out, serious? <laughs> I just I'm I am i am 21. Yeah, yeah. I'm able to drink yeah. this year. I know, I forget. Yeah, I forget how young you are. You're old though. You got like an old mind. Old shit. soul. Yeah, old soul. But uh not old mind. <laughs> that like. means you're lame as fuck, by <laughs> no, the way. That's damn. exactly what that means. <laughs> <laughs> but uh back in the day when they first came out, they were like literally Red Bull, like half Red Bull. And then yeah, it was like an energy drink. Yeah. I knew, I've heard the lore. Yeah, but they killed people. I wasn't around for that. But yeah. They, oh, but wow. they used to, f two of those, two of those tall boys, gone. Yeah. Uh, three of them, you're, you're throwing up and you're hurting. Ooh, you're, yeah. you're feeling bad. Dude, now, they have a fucking Warheads flavor for <sighs> Loco. It's a painful drink, dude. It's a painful drink. So sour and the alcohol taste, it doesn't work well. Will I drink one? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so what year were they doing uh, energy drinks, half that, and half like alcohol? That was like when they first came out. Yeah, that was back when I think I had already graduated, though. So it was like probably 2010 or something, maybe a little bit before that. The Four oh, Loco wow. Gold is my favorite. 
I never had that. That golden pineapple, dude. That sounds good. That beautiful cylinder, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! So I like that. I love that uh, HGTV joke. You gonna keep that in there? Yeah, yeah. I I keep trying to remember it. Like I did, uh, I did it once, and then I brought it back. That was the first time I brought it back after. Like two months. Oh, you had done it before this? Yeah, I did it once at Rocket Republic. Oh, okay, okay. And it went over pretty well. And then I tried it once at the Speakeasy mic when it first started. And then that was the first time I brought it back since then. Yeah. But I like that joke, man. I love it. I think it's funny. Yeah, it but is funny. It, it's Does real it hit or miss. Well? It's real hit or miss. It it's is. either it gets good laughs all the way through mm-hmm. or it doesn't. kind of crashes and burns. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hey, did you? Does, has Nico ever seen you do karaoke? No. Remember? Oh, my gosh. Dude, he was telling us you were, like, amazing. Yeah, dude. and he was like, you're a That's rapper. Yeah. Nico, you're a fucking rat, dude. <laughs> you're a fucking piece of shit for that. Because I specifically remember telling you I can't fucking sing. <laughs> I can't sing at all. It sounds so monotone and off-key, dude. It's one of my biggest insecurities. It's my singing and also my dancing. So fuck you, Nico, for being able to sing. And fuck you, Bryce Fletcher, for being able to dance, dude. Damn, I was going you're the to only white feature, dude I know man. that can dance. <laughs> You're not even like a trustable white to be around. If a fucking party breaks out, a flash mob dance circle, oh. I'm the only one that can't dance. Dude. No, I can't dance. Bryce is bitch ass. Bryce can dance better than me, and I'm and I'm black, so mm. he'll be in there. He he's always <laughs> moving, <laughs> doing his shit. Bryce Fletcher, that's his own today. Yeah, oh, true. no way. Oh true. shit. Oh wait, we might be in different clothes because we might not be yeah. shooting today. <laughs> yeah. But uh, today, when you see it, it'll be Bryce Fletcher. Mm-hmm. Fucking hilarious. Love Bryce. Dude, he's yeah, funny, yeah. man. And he's a cool dude. Like, you guys are going to be like, oh, I kind of want to hang out with Bryce. But he yeah. will sneak diss you, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah that's the best part. <laughs> Get a sneak diss from Bryce. <laughs> he sneak dissing me last night, dude. We are standing inside the lobby at Shenanigans, and Bri- I was wearing this hoodie with, like, a flannel over it because it was cold. And Sci-Fi was like, I like your vibe, man. You're, like, white trash vibe, but you wouldn't call me the N-word. And then Bryce was like, it's not even that fucking hard to do, man. Like, it's just layering. I'm like, fuck you, Bryce. You're wearing your fucking work uniform, dude. You put in zero effort for the this. The tight-ass shirt this nigga be wearing. Right. <laughs> that fucking camo shirt, dude. Yeah, see his nipples through that motherfucker, <laughs> boy. You better get some tape. <laughs> Cut glass with those things, dude. Put that shit away. There are children around. Yo, Brandon's I'm, here. Hell yeah. But no, as I was to do, I'm not going to lie. Brett, who are you staring at over here? <laughs> he looked here? at the other camera. Like, he looked my at bad, the y'all. other camera. Look, I'm over it. I'm not even over that motherfucker. My he bad, knows, y'all. Dude, it's like fucking like, right there. Dude, you got your own camera. Hello. My bad. <laughs> but anyways, <laughs> dude, I used to think he was doing like wrestling and stuff when he pulled up all them waters. Like, I was like, dude, what is he getting ready for? He training for something. I right, just a really fit guy. Yeah. 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 I don't know. Mm-hmm. If you can ever stop zinning, dude. Yeah. Vaping. Zinning and stealing yeah. my cigarettes. <laughs> Even though I offer them to He him asked me last night if I had cigarettes. I was like, fuck no, dude. I'm not there yet. Give me a few years, man. I, I like I like to open up the pack. Like if, if we're out somewhere, and I like to open up the pack and don't ask him right away if he wants one. And, and he just watches. It, he, he can't he can't help it. He's just like looking down the pack, looking up. Salivating. <laughs> yeah. Gosh, dude. He's yeah. looking at that cigarette like a pit bull looks at a two year old. <laughs> just ready, dude. He can't fucking shake it and shit. Tweaking. <laughs> He's fucking stupid. Uh, All right. Well, that's all for us. This week's featured comedian. Internet pornography. Yay! 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 It turns out my sister's biggest favorite porn star is Owen Gray. Want to start this day? Yeah, yeah, we might as well. Uh, today our guest is Ooh. the worst type of white dude. He's the worst. My least favorite type of white dude because he can dance. Yep. Ooh. That makes me the only one that can't if I'm in the group with him. So that's fun. He always has a gallon of water because he's athletic and sporty <laughs> and cool. The strongest comic in Huntsville. Extremely powerful. Avenger <laughs> level strength. Mm-hmm. It's Bryce Fletcher, dude. That's hey, me. What's up? Hey, yeah, what's up? 
Be I'm nasty. Excited to be up, here, man? dudes. The Hell sneak yeah, disser of all sneak dissers, dude. Well, I don't sneak this. He dude. slides it, in, but it's to your face, so I guess it's not sneak yeah, dissing, exactly. but it goes over your head. And I only say it to you. That's <laughs> fucked up, dude. It's fucked up. <laughs> Brother's name is Chad. <laughs> yeah. White boy names. That's unfortunate, man. Bryce and Chad, man. Dude. Have, have you did your ancestry to see how white you are? Oh, I don't want to know. You don't want to know? What do you think it is? Or do you know? Uh, I think it's just German and then go, hey. <laughs> definitely got the German in there for sure. Good on um, No, nah, I think it's just all white guy stuff. What do you got? <laughs> Dude, my sister made my whole family do ours mm-hmm. and we kind of had different results. So I'm thinking I might not actually be related to these people after all. But anyways, <laughs> it, it was, happens. it's like it happens. it's British, it's Irish, it's Ger- it's it's the white shit, dude. Mm-hmm. And then it's like that one one and a half percent sub-Saharan African that you all know you is go. from slavery, but you just don't talk about it. You, you know? said one and a half? Yeah, oh, you something like it. that. It's sub two percent. I don't you can say think the hard so. R. I don't. Mm-hmm. You know, it's kind of a that's lot. an opinion. Two yeah. percent. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try it. I'll try it at a uh, box car on Sunday. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> it's like, don't worry, guys. You know, Mike Perry did that. The UFC fighter. Nah. He tested his DNA. He was like one percent black, so he just said the N word. He thought it was okay. <laughs> Everybody shit on him for it. Yeah, he didn't I mean, think it was okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he said that. All he right, let me rephrase. He, he knew he, he was a UFC was. fighter, <laughs> and he could probably right? <laughs> whoop their ass. Yeah. Oh my god. Just like man. when Tyson Fury beat Wilder like that, they were like, "You just," and they showed an old video of him saying mm-hmm. "nigga," and it was like, "We was like, we sent our best. <laughs> <laughs> what, we what sent the, our best guy. What the fuck this is our number one about? dude, bro? Yeah. What am I gonna do? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Beat my ass? No, thank you." <laughs> You're you're a hard person to find information oh, on, man. I try to be. What what's your occupation? Mm, I work at a sporting goods store. Hell yeah. Access to firearms. Mm-hmm. Ooh, that is true. <laughs> Scary. That's something, that dude. is true. Scary. <laughs> uh, yeah. Camouflage. Gilly suits. <laughs> See, he's naming shit I ain't even thought of yet. I think about it all day. That's all I think about. <laughs> like, how can I hurt people with what Folding I got? Folding chairs in case you get <laughs> <Yeah>. tired. <laughs> No, we're scared of those. We're white. Oh, we're, we're afraid of those. We don't like Not them. the metal ones. Dude. Yeah, I, st- I steer clear. The cloth ones, the textiles, dude. <laughs> no, dude, we, we're trying to. St- we stalk all our guests. We have an extensive research process that That's consists of multiple me. layers of validation. What you got? No, not much, no. dude. You University of North Alabama. <laughs> now I knew this before. You linked in me. Okay. <laughs> you have fifteen skills on my LinkedIn, resume. Actually, okay. <laughs> you actually have fifteen skills on there. You really do. <laughs> but yeah, so marketing, marketing, is that it? Yes, sir. Did you graduate with a marketing degree? This is a job. Uh, it was a category management degree. Okay, what the fuck is that? What dude? it was? T- it was sold to me as like some sort of specific degree that'll guarantee me like six figures straight out of college. Mm-hmm. That was a lie. It was not true. So it's like it's more like in like uh, inside of a store, you'll have like categories of stuff, right? Like. Hard goods, soft goods, candy, blah, blah, blah. How do you manage that within a store? That was my that was my degree. Oh, okay, damn, okay. dude. Yeah, and pretty you cool. Is it hard to find something with that? Uh, well, you had to have like a lot of like computer shit that mm. I don't have. Oh, fuck that, dude. But yeah, also, I was no. just like, I think I'm just going to do comedy. This, yep. this yeah. Sucks. Yeah. yeah. And he's fucking good, folks. Anytime you see his name on a flyer, you go out there, because this motherfucker Come see me. He's a hero. Here. He'll know yeah. from his jokes. <laughs> I'm a hero. <laughs> I'm a good guy. He's also the toughest guy in Huntsville comedy. I'm the strongest <laughs> fighter. Strongest fighter in Huntsville comedy. You got pretty deep on those squats. I was impressed yeah, by yeah. that. I'm definitely the most nimble. You're definitely the strongest guy that smokes cigarettes in Huntsville comedy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't smoke that many cigarettes. So yeah, uh, light get, cigarette you That's how I get you. Oh, I'm you sponsored do. by all kinds of stuff. Celsius, Zen. What Celsius, Zen. Zen. These yeah. are my yeah. superpower equipment, huh? Yeah, those Zens. Yeah, I dip these too much. Do you? Way too much. But yeah, they don't have any, like... Nothing negative can happen to you. <laughs> yeah, well, your jaw Andrew still Huberman that's said it will make you live forever, dude. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he said it'll make you way smarter than you are. For real? Yeah. Somehow. Real. Oh, his jokes are smart. Maybe it does work. Mm-hmm. Do you I zen mean, while you write jokes? I sure do. Would you recommend that to all the com- up and coming comedians out there? Uh, Start yeah. zenning. Yeah. Do you like your heart to feel weird? Oh, oh, you get the palpitations, yeah. dude? I'm about to die, hurry. Yeah. Live life on the edge, bro. That should be their motto, their slogan. 
Live life on the edge. Life on the edge, dude. Yeah, dude, this is just the threes too. They got sixes. Yeah, some brands know. have like sevens and nines and shit. That's crazy. Yeah, and people yeah. will put multiple in it. Two at or time. three. But yeah. dude, I think I told you about this. I never like vape, smoke cigarettes, or whatever. And then my friend gave me a six milligram Zen, and I put it in. And like ten minutes later, I could not walk in a straight line. <laughs> I felt like I was drunk, and then I got so sick, dude. It was the worst. So what all do you do? Do you not? You smoke weed, you drink beer, is that about it? Yeah. You don't do cigarettes, you don't... I don't... I don't. I, I won't nothing. ever, like, go and buy alcohol, like, for myself. But if I'm out somewhere, I'll have a drink. Or You've if, never like, bought alcohol? I'm not saying that. <laughs> That's kind of... I mean, he was. he's young, though. You know, he just... When did you turn 21? Over the summer. Oh, okay. Yeah. Time. Give it time. Yeah. Get, get, get the time. sadness get. set in, dude. <laughs> yeah, if I keep bombing pack. like this, dude, Shut this could go downhill yeah. fast. <laughs> you could get yourself a six pack, a little Greg shooter Odin. on the side. <laughs> yeah. Oh, a little whiskey. Yeah, it's just for me. <laughs> now, there's. there's get you, <laughs> no, we're not done with this. <laughs> I, <laughs> well, you know, my it, alcoholism yeah, yeah. runs in my family, dude. So Same these. Oh. Yeah. Okay. That was supposed to be funnier than it was. Yeah, you know, he's, trying, got, to, he's trying to dunk on me with sadness. You hear that? Hell yeah. no. Yeah, he's dude. trying to sadness dunk. <laughs> Hell no. It yeah. was. I don't know what it was supposed to be, but it was supposed to be better than that. No. What, that your family's with alcoholics? Everybody's is. Yeah, right? that's, that's very common yeah, for I mean, a I mean, comedian uh, to have alcoholic parents. Yeah. I feel oh, like. yeah. I mean, I wouldn't want it any other way, really. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't have had half the experiences that I had, dude. (laughs) Especially you. You got some crazy ass ones, dude. True. I was. He is wild. Oh my gosh. I was. I was thinking about this recently. I was talking to my dad yesterday, and he was. uh, We had we were over at his house, and we walked into his bedroom. I haven't been there Mm -hmm. in a while, and he has the bedroom of like a teenage boy. (laughs) It's insane. He. My dad's a character, bro. I love my dad, but he went. He we walked in, and it's just like pictures of tigers, <laughs> and like comic book posters, <laughs> and like LED lights around the corners. It's like an Did he insane. Have little stars side. on the top that glow. Dude, in the dark. Glow in the dark <laughs> not those, dude. But I guess he's not there yet. But maybe he's Benjamin Button now that I think about it. He's gotten older. You think and he's, he's regressing. He's yeah. mentally regressing, uh, but his body stays the same. That's interesting. It's like tigers are cool as hell when you're like 11 years hell old, yeah. dude. And Brandon. I have a tattoo of a tiger. I really <laughs> shouldn't be talking about like, Hell shit. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> True. Tigers are cool. I mean, they're not, not cool. <laughs> yeah. I was, I'm talking all that shit. I have a tiger tattoo. No, you don't. <laughs> I do. You got a tiger tattoo? Where? Yeah, right here. Shoulder? Yeah. I'm talking all that shit. They are cool, dude. <laughs> <They're pretty laughs> I cool, changed my actually. stance. <laughs> I forgot, dude. Damn, yeah. it's fucking funny. So what what advice do you have for any uh, younger up-and-coming comedians? Just give us one, and we'll let you off after that. I just write a lot. Right. Do you, do you guys write a bunch? Yeah. Try to like I had to like switch up how I wrote because I was getting too robotic. Okay, I was writing so much that. that I was getting specific word to word, and you could hear it on stage, and it was me remembering it. So don't do that with your writing, okay. Brandon. Don't do that. Uh, I would always write just like uh, bullet points and try to fill it up with like uh, in time thoughts, like real time thoughts in the middle, and then bullet point your hard jokes, and then everything else. You know, keep it soft, keep it conversational. Damn, you, but you, do you focus on your tags whenever you're writing that in between though? Yeah, or that's a part of that's part of it. But they, those come naturally, and then okay. you try to reuse them, and then sometimes they fall off because it was such an in the moment thing. Mm. Yeah. But you know, you always just try it, try to keep those. That's what I've been doing recently. Yeah, but I've been living in comedy for like four years. Yeah, so, you know, four year pro right too. here. Four year, right. <laughs> four year, four year pro <laughs> hero. Yeah, I gotta stop swaying. <laughs> and four then, year veteran, dude. Yeah, in the NBA, you'd be a veteran. The right. journeyman. There you go. Yeah, dude. What do you? Um, what's a crazy thing that happened at one of your shows? Uh, nothing. Oh, I, w- I was told oh. that Bryce assaulted somebody. At one oh, of shows. Yeah. We need to hear about this. I was gonna say nothing at all. Oh yeah, one time I did hit him, man. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, what was that about, dude? Uh, he was talking all that shit, and I'm the strongest fighter <laughs> that's ever lived. Hey, so man. I had to show him what's up. Self fulfilling. Now he prophecy. was uh he was like we were at a, the first open mic at the bar 805, right? Okay. And did you guys ever go to that one, the bar no. eight oh five? Okay. So yeah. It was a it was kind of it's it's a fine 
bar or whatever. But the clientele would be a little rough, especially when we first got there. They weren't quite, you know, we hadn't run them off yet. Yeah. Quite. As an open mic, that kind of happens sometimes. <laughs> oh, but I can see that. Uh, yeah, we go up. We're there, and they're like the old regulars. It's right. It's the very first night. My boy Brent's hosting. He's up there. He's squeaking around. You know how he is. Oh, I don't know if you guys know him. Is that the one that just got up on Kill Tony? Yeah. Yeah. What's well, Heath? No. He came. He went up after. He you. went up like last week. Oh, okay. He was just on it. You didn't like, even know. Super. No, I don't watch Kill Tony. Is he like skinny? Um... <laughs> yeah, Brent with the spiky hair. Uh, I don't know. I know if he he is. Is. Okay. Okay. Anywho, they're talking shit about him, mm-hmm. right? And I go up there and I'm drunk, right? This is back when I used to drink, so I'm, I'm like, I'm wilding out a little bit. And so I go up there and I walk up to him. I'm like, hey, man, you know, as the, this is like the classic thing the comics say. It was like, hey, the sign up sheet's over there, buddy. Yeah, once you go uh, sign yeah. up, you know, that's what I go tell him. He's and he's he start he leans back in his chair, right? I don't want to do it because I don't want to get off mic. But he like leans back in his chair, looks at me and said, "I'll fucking kick your ass, dude." Yeah, which is the most that's so cocky. Yeah, yeah. you don't even have gravity on your side, that's right? <laughs> they have nothing going for you, dude. So I like smack the end of the chair, and he flips backwards, hits his head, rolls over, and gets split up. Uh, some other guy comes over and punches him in the face, which is pretty wild. Yeah, some got, random dude. Yeah, I got clout Damn, like that, dude. dude. Yeah, <laughs> you got, I got shooters, fight. bro. I just, I, just start, I just started and walk off like that. Damn, let the dude. explosion happen in front of me. Cool but guys yeah. don't look at explosions, dude. <laughs> right. Um, uh, yeah. You just start shit. <laughs> you don't finish. It. <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty epic. Others fight. finish it for you. Yes. <laughs> yeah. that, that's, that's the whole thing. That's what I'm recruiting you two for, bro. What? More hitters. <laughs> oh yeah, I got you, bro. Okay, I, know I ain't gonna do. be as good as you. Don, okay, Don might actually go to prison for you. <laughs> like that just act, like you'll be talking to Dom. He's like, oh yeah, and then I was in prison. I was like, what? <laughs> no, first of all, jail. <laughs> <laughs> you got tiger game. tattoos, bro. You're yeah. gonna fight. I know oh, you dude, can. You're fight. up next, bro. <laughs> I already know you can fight. I'm, I'm a you got a mullet guy, and tiger man. tattoos, bro. You can fight. Well, that just means I don't have a lot to lose, obviously. Yeah, <laughs> I don't true, have a lot of respect yeah. for myself, so I don't have a lot of respect for anybody else either. JJ can knock somebody out. I think so. Big boy. No he's he's bigger a, than you think. Mm-hmm. I'm a peaceful man, dude. Peaceful man. Yeah. yeah Let's lead with Jesus. That's dude. what scary people say, bro. Yeah. Those are the ones who blow up hey. and just... Mm-hmm. Snap. Take somebody by the hair and just drag them down the parking lot. <laughs> just ISIS saw somebody's head off and yeah. can of bar. That's what I'm saying. You got your dad in you, bro. And he sleeps with his clothes on. Ready and has, to a, go, and has a little boy's room. So <laughs> I think he might murder people, too. He might, dude. I think he might have that in you. He might. <laughs> He's definitely probably killed someone. Yeah. Dude, I don't know if he has, but if Is it, a it wouldn't be the biggest shock in okay. my life. You know, it'd be like, oh, yeah, sky's blue. I knew that. <laughs> that he doesn't still kill people? That's good. I don't think he does. <laughs> That's pretty no. cool. It's not He's a progress. Progress. Yeah. You, you got to give you got to give a boy a chance to grow a little bit before you start judging him now, dude. For <laughs> me, for for the Peyton family it just takes about 50 years. And then we're like mentally 16. <laughs> <laughs> Operate a vehicle, dude. Oh yeah. I love that shit. Little Peyton family. Yeah. yeah. That's my last name, by the way, yeah. Dom. I know Patton. you always... No, <laughs> it's Peyton, dude. Colin Patton? No, he fucking him Patton mispronounces it all the time. Yeah. DJ Patton? Patton. Mm-hmm. I don't know why I think Patton. Dude, think Gary I, Peyton. Yeah, Peyton. Walter Peyton. Mm-hmm. All the famous black athletes, dude. Yeah. And me. <laughs> I'm not there yet. <laughs> Give it a few years, dude. When trans ethnicity becomes a thing, I'm the Are you switching boy, over, bro? <laughs> No, I, I'm I holding do. down. I'm staying white. Staying white. <laughs> yeah, even if you could I mean, switch, I, mean, I wouldn't yeah. switch. I'm not Why a. Would you? I'll say it, I'll stay white, but because I can I'm already not dance. A, I'm not so. a loyal white. You're not a loyal white. I'm not a loyal white. Hog on him, dude. <laughs> 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 He's got a big fat fucking dick, too. I know. I've that seen too. it. Too. <laughs> I've heard the stories. I heard about it. Yeah, yeah. I heard about it. Like, Big, big Bryce eyes. is what we used to call him when he first started. <laughs> he would just slam through the open micers. <laughs> then he got in a fight. <laughs> yeah. Now he's the strongest. This guy's he the ascended above sex. Yeah. He's, he's strong. <laughs> he ascended above sex. <laughs> if you're strong enough, you don't have to have sex. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's cool. You get it. People get it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> No, the girls are too scared. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Joe Rogan has a really good joke about that. What's where he's that? like, I'm not scared of Brock Lesnar. I'm scared that Brock Lesnar would use me as a condom to fuck somebody way bigger. Yeah. Oh my God. Jake was telling us about that last week. 
I, what, 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 that was like on one of his first ones, right? No, that couldn't have been. I think you. I mean, I think Lesnar was already in the UFC at that point. Oh, okay, okay. Sure. That is a big motherfucker. Could you imagine? Hell yeah, bro. Could Hell you imagine no. this dude just comes press you at the bar? Dude, he's so big in my store, they sell barbecue sauce with his face on it. <laughs> That's, you know how big you gotta be? <laughs> you I would buy it, dude. <laughs> how dare you? <laughs> Make some wings with Ooh. it. Ooh. <laughs> Brock Lesnar, dude. Lesnar F5. Sauce. <laughs> yeah, F5. It's a tornado. Yeah. Is it called the Beast Barbecue Sauce? No. Oh, damn, dude. Just, I, just, I think it's just called Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar's yeah, the solid, solid only, that, like, type of white dude that's scary, I feel like. Oh, who's, God. like, genuinely terrifying. Well, in that way, and big scary. Yeah. yeah. And I've aggressive. Seen, I've seen, I grew up in, like, like New Market, like, in the trailer park area, <laughs> bro. There's some scary, like, skinny, scrawny dudes who just, like, he might be, like, like in a crawl space in those your are, house. Those are addicts, <laughs> dude. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Addicts. That's scary, too. <laughs> True. Yeah. Those Good are the walking that. dead, bro. Yeah. That's a two, that's two kind of white scaries we got. I believe it. Oh my gosh, dude! I used to I used to work um, at a store over near New Hope, but okay. it was like right in the border where people from Hampton Cove would come and people from New mm-hmm. Hope would come, and it was just like the two different subsections of white people in the South, just like the really rich like Southern <laughs> aristocracy and the fucking peasants, dude. The serfs. Oh yeah, they're breaking beer bottles in the parking lot. <laughs> There's Confederate flags. Dude. Hell yeah. They're Nobody yelling. has a shirt on, bro. <laughs> Zero shirts. For sure. Oh yeah, I grew yeah. up in Newmarket. That's the same. Yeah. All that shit because they had like the Riverton kids and the Newmarket mm-hmm. kids all formed at Buckhorn. Oh, I so got we, you. So like, we merged in, but we I was the Newmarket kids, so we were like we were the peasants, right? Oh, okay. Yeah. So we like we I was always associated with those guys, which is weird. Yeah. No, so, it's the same thing with Spartman. You have yeah, yeah. Spartman middle kids and then the Monrovia middle kids. And it's they're like not the, the, they're, they're like the shady ones. That's who they are. No, that's who we were. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's yeah. the Spartman kids yeah, like yeah. that. Well, they were just like, yeah, that's like the lower okay, class. Okay, okay. Lower yeah. class. Yeah, poor whites. I know poor whites well. You do. I, I Those say, are the even, open even, <laughs> even if you're... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> even if you're like, you know, you're well off now, mm-hmm. I can probably... I like, I like to think I can tell if you were a poor white growing up well i we had shrimp outside i didn't use any of the sauce yeah that is not a good indicator oh, I was just, oh it's already good. on it I see like, i didn't even yeah. know about that I, like, I didn't know that was a thing you put shrimp with no cock you judged shrimp me so cocktail. hard <laughs> yeah. from across oh. the room well i was looking i was like is <laughs> i don't think that's a class shrimp? thing though <laughs> <laughs> i think that's more of cultural yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> you season your chicken with just salt and pepper huh no dude i eat good food do you all right yeah okay all right well poor whites do they can't cook were you a poor white growing up uh, no, we weren't poor. I poor. just grew up around the poor people. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> but we weren't I, I, poor, I didn't but take you as a poor. Yeah. yeah, but I grew up near it. Like I didn't know anything else. Mm-hmm. You know, we didn't have like cool stuff. My parents were very frugal. Okay, if that okay. makes sense. Like they didn't spend money on nothing. No doctor, like nothing. <laughs> oh, that's damn, how my dude. mom was. Yeah, dude. so it was like it's like being poor. <laughs> well, yeah, you have options, but you not you can never <laughs> You're get them. Choosing <laughs> to be poor, dude. Yeah, yeah. They choose the poor lifestyle. <laughs> Hell yeah. There's something respectable yeah, about that. I'm down with right. it. It's probably not fun when you're yeah. a kid. I mean, I didn't think anything of it. I didn't know any better. True. You know. No, it was fine. When I was a kid, I totally just applied my own life. I was like, that's how everybody lives. Exactly. Yeah. Like, yeah. Nobody lives different you than You don't this. think anything of it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Then I went over to like a friend's house. I'm like, what are you talking about? You don't have a fridge full of soda? Like, you, ha- you drink water? I thought that was an option when I was a kid. To I what? didn't know you had to drink water. <laughs> I swear, from the ages of <laughs> of probably like four to twelve, I probably drank six cans of Pepsi a day. I'm not kidding. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, that's why I'm so fucked up now, dude. You do got that Mountain Dew uh, face. <laughs> oh, Mountain dude, that was face. my dad, bro. Mountain Dew. You look like you ride the. Dude, I was more man. of a Mountain Dew Code Red kind of. Hey, that's dude. That I was shit. real trash. Mountain Dew Code Red's amazing. Bro. It's just yeah. Red Forty. It's just drinking Red Forty and sugar. <laughs> just the part you're not supposed to it drink. It makes you an idiot, bro. <laughs> What's your guys' favorite soda? Diet root beer. This right here dude. is the best one. That that's one? My, that's what my is that? favorite. It's the Diet uh, Cherry 7 Up, dude. It's you got to order it offline? No, Walmart. No, dude. dude. This is in, in wow, your man. local retailer. Did you get this? It's for yeah. me. All right. I didn't know it was his favorite. I didn't know it was me too on one on this. No, that's not my favorite. Well, though. I only drink diet soda, but my favorite non diet soda is the Cherry Lemon Sundrop in the red can. Oh, that's Bro, that's it's good. so fucking good. 
I'm Sounds so good. passionate about this. <laughs> <laughs> I love soda. Yeah, I just drink like regular shit, I guess. You I like said diet, diet root, root beer, beer though, right? Yeah. Which, which root beer? A&W. A&W. A&W, for A&W. Sure. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. That's, well, Diet Mountain Dew is super good because it tastes just like Mountain Dew. Yeah, man. Just like it. So yeah. that's a good alternative. I drink diet uh, root beer, though. <laughs> I will say if you drink a Diet 7-Up, uh, or no, Diet Sun Drop, and you smoke a cigarette, it tastes like a regular Sun Drop. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know. <laughs> Checks and balance. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cost you a little more, but <laughs> save it costs you more in a different way. Yeah. yeah. Like, you save you some cards anyway. Yeah. Uh-huh. Not sometimes. So, did you ever buy cigarettes? <laughs> yeah, like in college and stuff. Did you For ever? real? Mm-hmm. What'd you smoke? Damn, dude. I was smoking, bro. Hmm? What'd you smoke? Marlboro NXTs. I was an NXT that? boy. Huh? They're just like the ones you pop. Oh, like, yeah. like oh. Camel Crush. Yeah, yeah. The Marble. It's the Marble version of that. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Mm hmm. Yeah. New York. They were great. People, because people will, you know, people always like, oh, you got menthol? Oh, you got regular? I got both. <laughs> now, it's weird that I was thinking of other people while I was buying my cigarettes. Right? But Because everybody's it's the kind of guy that I am. You know? You're a communal guy, dude. Yeah. <laughs> you got to share the herbs with the tribe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a tribe leader, bro. That's what happens. <laughs> you got to come back with the goods. Fucking alpha male over here. Yeah, like, yeah. Just, but I was also in a fraternity, so I was definitely going to share uh, these cigarettes yeah, with Pike, people. Pike, right? Pike, Pike. Yeah, I'm a Pike, yeah. yeah. But yeah, the, no, um, how was how was frat like? I really didn't <laughs> pin you as a frat guy beforehand. Well, that's a good thing, right? Yeah, no, that yeah, is yeah. a good thing. There's some cool frat guys out there. Also, it's a D2 like, school, so it's not like... UNA is... I think it's D1 now, is it not? Now it's D1. It was D2 when I was there, and it's oh. still very, like, it's not like... It's on the borderline, dude. You're not getting, like, the super rich people in there. Like, everybody has jobs. Young Gravy had a mm. concert there last year. Young Gravy. That counts for anything. People always think I'm Young Gravy, dude. I don't even know. Hey, pull up Young Gravy. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I don't look like him. But people, like, I have people all the time, every week. I get. I used to get Jack Harlow a lot. Now it's more Lil Dicky and Young Gravy. Really? Yeah. Some uh, Post Malone. Who's telling you? Uh, I might be able to see Post. This dude, bro. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, Back before I cut my hair. We'll put, we'll put a picture of him down here. I'll let you guys No, decide. they know. You're just old, Dom. They know who <laughs> Young Gravy is. Did you know Bryce? I've heard of Young Gravy before. And He's I an alumni of UNA, UNA dude. Uh, is he? Yeah. For real? I didn't know that. No, you are. He performed. Oh, I thought you meant he was. <laughs> oh, I got you. He might. I don't know. I don't um, know his life like that. You don't dude. look like him, though. I don't yeah, think I do see, either. I don't see that one either. But that's more believable Morgan than Wallen. that Francis Ngannou, this Eastern European tax and driver. Oh, yeah. taxi Brandon driver, just thing. says wild shit. Yeah, no, check out episode two if you want to see that <laughs> reference. <laughs> hey, promo. Promo. <laughs> hey, we're at the shop, man. We always do open mics there. Silver Dollar Comedy. At, uh, oh, I'm, I'm guest hosting Silver Dollar Comedy Night, December 21st. Do a 10-minute set beforehand. Ooh. It could go either way. Ten minutes. You That's might not see one. me around anymore. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Bryce, I've seen you do some ten minutes. Sir. How you like them? What, ten minute sets? Yeah, ten minutes. They're fine. I'm up to like, uh, I can comfortably do like 15. Really? Yeah, really. Damn, yeah. That's you, good, man. I've seen you do ten minutes, dude, at a Don't Tell with mm-hmm. Cannon Bar. Yeah, that was a fun show. That was a good one, dude. That was a good one. That was dude, a good one. That was a wild show. Well, that there's a one really funny moment that I'll always remember from that show. <laughs> what happened? Because you went up first, didn't you? Uh, yeah, yeah. After the host, yeah. Yeah, and uh, Bryce, he was saying some porn joke, and he was you asked the audience if anybody Mm-mm. had a favorite porn star. No, Jonathan did. Oh, John. Oh, John. Yeah. You, but you did talk about porn in your set, of course. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I, I need it always. Yeah, I <laughs> ten minutes, it. dude. I'm talking yeah, about dude, porn. Are you serious? <laughs> Of course. But yeah, Jonathan asked, and this girl yells out from the crowd, Owen Gray, who I've heard his name several times. Mm-hmm. I think that's a that's a guy. Porn star. I think he's a yeah. Yeah. Do you know I think Owen he's a master Gray? of the Before we continue, crowd. do you know who Owen Gray is? Pull up a picture of Owen Gray. Yeah, pull, up, pull, up, pull, up, pull him up. <laughs> but um <laughs> a, a girl yelled it out. Put it in incognito mode. Bow 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 bow. Huh? I don't give a fuck. Damn. <laughs> gray. Right, right there, first one. No, that's gravy, oh, bro. <laughs> but not so <laughs> gravy. That's a way worse guy. <laughs> yeah, this little skinny white Oh, dude. no. I, with the tattoos. I was he was the with bald the, one. Click on the one with yeah. the tattoos, Brandon. He's kind of oh, weird yeah. looking. Bro. Yeah, that one. Man, this dude doesn't look Wait, like that's him. not him. I don't know. Oh, no, there, like Is it him? One of 
Is that him? I, that's not who I was thinking of. Yeah, I was also thinking of somebody. Dude, the bald tattoos. dude? No, that's Johnny Sims. Johnny Sims, that's the one. He's I'm known for his leg tattoos. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're way too into this. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that oh, one. He's blacked out. All right, type in dick. <laughs> 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 come on like stroke, stroke <laughs> come on no just kidding no, 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 no but yeah that's what everybody knows him for it's like yeah, crazy yeah. ass tattoo that's how that's anyways so jonathan asked the out like hey somebody named their favorite porn star nobody responds but my fucking sister who's in the audience she goes oh and gray i love well you. i didn't know it was his sister because he yeah. was, Jonathan was like, uh, does anybody have a favorite porn star? And she and this girl was like, Owen Gray. And then Bryce was like, that's my sister. Or did you go on stage and say, that's my sister? Yeah, I think I whispered it to somebody. It might have been you. Was it, like, dude, that was it my was sister. It was me, dude. Yeah, yeah. That's why. You're right, dude. Yeah, but I, I whispered like, to him. I was like, dude, that was my fucking sister. He was like, <laughs> what? She knows he's here. <laughs> that's crazy. We are from Alabama. Not that's accusing a, Dude, that's how everybody in my family is, though. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They just don't give a fuck. Saying the wrong thing at the wrong fucking time. <laughs> I love those people. Oh, yeah. Hell I do man. it too, man. You got yeah. to, man. Otherwise, it's just weird. Yeah, it's just no fun. I don't know. Just fucking let it out. Be awkward. Make other people awkward. That's my thing. Is that oh, what you do? I love it. So you're like, the worst, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're the worst to be around when you're high. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, Because yeah. you're like, like, oh, no. Dude, chill. <laughs> I'll find out what you don't like, and then uh, <laughs> oh, we'll go that. for that specifically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Not nothing hard, you know. what I'm saying that's but, what I was worried about with this interview. I was like, well, dang, they're gonna say oh, the things man. I don't want to hear. But no, this is no, fine really. so far. No, no, dude, we're, we're, we're <laughs> user friendly. I do want to say True. though, somebody wrote on the notes, and it wasn't me. You look like you say, "I'm gonna go bananas" when you get mad. <laughs> <laughs> but, but. You see how Dom wrote it on <laughs> here? He me. put the whole entire thing in quotation marks. Not just the I'm going to go bananas part. <laughs> no, 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 when no. you get mad, I say that out loud too. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. You're that like, wasn't me. I didn't write did that it? one. <laughs> it wasn't me, dude. It wasn't you, was it? Yeah, it was. Damn. I wrote some on mine just in pen that I wanted to remember to bring up. Okay. I know me and Dom are part of Clown College Comedy. Me and Bryce are actually part of another <laughs> comedy group, me, Bryce, and Sci-Fi, called the Pooh Boys. <laughs> Would you like to elaborate no, on that? you Bryce? elaborate. <laughs> well, basically, we smoked a joint outside of shenanigans before the shit show, and I've never been to one. I didn't know how it worked. You go around and you hand people little foam shits to throw at their least favorite comedian mm-hmm. in that round. And Sci-Fi volunteered to work the show. I didn't know that. Me and Bryce didn't know that. And then he incorporated us to help him, like, pass out the shit. But I was tweaking, bro. I yeah, could I was not stoned. do it. I was so hot. You guys were- I just ended up, like, by the end of it, I was just standing in the lobby. I wasn't even in the same room. <laughs> yeah, he, he deteriorated throughout the night. He went from holding a bucket... To me giving him some from my bucket. To him just not being there anymore. (laughs) I had to remove myself from the situation. He just slowly but surely was not a part of the Pooh Boys anymore. (laughs) Well, I also tried to hand out the shit to the people who were on the show because I didn't watch their sets. Oh, yeah. And they were like, I'm on the show. And I was like, dude, I didn't know. (laughs) You're in the green room. Yeah, why are you back here? Yeah. (laughs) Oh, yeah, Sci-Fi was like, have you been in the green room before? And we were walking back there, and I was like, no, not yet. And he's like... (laughs) <laughs> he told you stop me. He's like, no, dude. Understandable. You gotta earn it. You'll be on there soon. Dude, you Without two, a doubt. Both of you dudes, bro. What? He's on it tonight. I, and you've done you a show at Shenanigans. Mm-hmm. Is that where it's at? Yeah, yeah. Shenanigans oh, okay. at eight. Yeah. So you're already in there, dude. He'll he'll be on there. I mean, you know JJ's fucking funny. His writing is. Yeah, he's so funny. Oh, his writing. JJ is such a funny, handsome man. This is the dude. worst, dude. It's the worst. Look at him. Yeah, I fucking hate him, dude. It's the worst. <laughs> Nobody wants to sit there while it's like, oh man, you're the greatest, and you just you're like, no, dude. <laughs> obviously not. No, he's awesome. Oh, you good, man. Uh, Brandon, tell him he's good. Brandon, good. shut the fuck <laughs> up, Brandon. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, you guys Laughing are all good, awesome. dude. You guys are all real fucking good. We're in the same room, aren't we, dude? <laughs> same microphone, same podcast, same 130 views, dude. Hey, 
I'm down with it. That was more than I thought it was going to be. Wait, 130? Dude, I thought That's we were, not bad. I thought we were going to be banging at like 10. And I thought it was going to drop <laughs> yeah, off. You yeah. know what I mean? Like Seven. 10 people were going to watch it the first time. It's like, all right. And then after that, it's going to be like three, <laughs> one. We're just yeah, putting yeah, it off. Yeah, 130 nobody. already, dude. Fuck yeah. Man, dude. Uh, people. Uh, and I haven't listened to any of them. So <laughs> I think that's a good thing. Dude, are you going to listen to this episode? No. Are you yeah, going to be are. watching this moment right now? Yeah. Mm-mm. You Probably got to, not. man. No, do you guys like watching your? This is gonna get clipped. No, and somebody I have to edit it, it, so I have to watch it, and oh, I yeah, sound no retarded, <laughs> dude. I sound so <laughs> slow. Like I'm, I'm watching it, and I'm like, man, dude, can you get any words right? Like, <laughs> can I just speed up it'd my be part? like the easiest yeah. shit, easiest word. I'm like, you can't figure that one out, buddy. Can I just speed up my words? You need to get a counter, like a tally mark for how many times you say retarded on the podcast. <laughs> I don't. I think you said it every episode. Oh, I'm on. But I'm first of all, Brandon. Write that down, dude. <laughs> Timestamp that. Yeah, but I'm calling myself because I, I do have a tardation. I it's, it's something. <laughs> what about, is it? <laughs> look, I don't know exactly what it is, but <laughs> but I'm telling you, I can't say words right. Mm-hmm. I have to practice them. Like if I have one for my set, that's the, I have to practice like words because I like to say big words because I think it coming from me. It sounds funny because I'm slow. You know what I'm saying? I don't think people see you as slow though. When I'm up there. <laughs> well, right now I do. It's alcohol. When you said that, now I see it. Actually, I take it all back. Now I see it. <laughs> He's like, when I'm on stage, like, yeah, that's what we're that's what we're talking about, big guy. That's the whole. That's point exactly of this, what you said. Did you forget? How did you not? Know? We made the map you right lose here you? for you. Yeah, <laughs> to remember. <laughs> Dom's like, these are the three places I have to go today. <laughs> on stage, <laughs> or this week, or do I just go in the building? <laughs> You're going to oh, tell me man. when it's my turn? But that, <laughs> yeah. I swear that's how I was the first. I was like, you're going in this order, right? How long do we have to talk for? It's the worst, oh, I dude. was miserable. I feel like you guys were so much more comfortable. Hell than I no. Am. I hate it. You bro. for sure are. Bro. I still hate it. I still fucking hate getting on stage. Really? When you tell your jokes, it sounds j- like on stage, it just sounds just like when you're telling them to us when we're talking and shit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you sound yeah. comfortable. But I'm telling you, dude, I fucking hate it. If I know I have an open mic that day, I'm not happy the whole day, dude. Oh, Until same. Until after it's same. over. Same. That's probably why. I'm like, gosh, You guys dude. are so polished. Yeah, we're just miserable. <laughs> yeah. Because I, I related to that thing you said earlier about like rehearsing and sounding too robotic when you mm-hmm. write. I yeah. I had that a lot when I like was first starting. Well, because like, when you're first starting, you before. don't have any, you never done good before, mm-hmm. so you have no reason to be confident in your ability just to do it. So it just takes time. You're like, oh, that did good, and you yeah. just walk a little further. No, oh, that did good. Walk a little further, and then eventually you get it. Mm-hmm. And I'm only four years in, so I'm sure I'm fucking up a lot more than I even know. Yeah, yeah. yeah but you, know you can tell, like, whenever I watch, like, I'm just talk- coming as a like. At this point, a fan mm-hmm. of comedy and stuff, and yeah. this is my first time going to open mics and shit like that. And then, as soon as I see you, I'm like, "Oh, okay." I you could have told me you were seven, eight years. I'm like, "Okay, this guy got it." And your jokes, are, I'm telling you, his jokes are so fucking good. You're my like of of all the comedians, I love your jokes. Well, I know he hates this, but <laughs> I, I love your jokes. Yeah, dude, man. JJ's so you're handsome, just so dude. Good. <laughs> JJ is handsome as hell, bro. Look at unparalleled. That's unpar- and your delivery, man. <laughs> you got, it's cool, calm, collected. So cool, you dude. fumble it, you recover. I you're fumble natural, it. Dude. There we go. Yeah, it's a it's an opera watching your fucking set, dude. There's ups, there's well, downs, dudes. Thanks, yeah, it's guys. amazing, dude. I you appreciate it. You do, but I will say you do have one of my favorite jokes, dude. Which one? Tell me. Well, I don't want to spoil it and like well, give it away on here. Well, that's the problem because a lot of people tell it, talk about it. I, well, this is weird now, but a lot of people talk about it and call it the midget porn joke. Right. Yeah. Oh, that's but that favorite, ruins yeah. it. You can't call it that. It's called the porn addiction joke. Porn okay, addiction okay. joke. And when it's when I record it on an album, I'll make sure that's specifically right. like called that. Oh, uh, but yeah. I love but the punchline is so smart. So like, thank you. Thank you, dude. I love it so much. Well, I'm not going to tell it, so we shouldn't talk around it, probably. Catch this but clip yeah. Yeah. <laughs> of Bryce saying yeah, it. Yeah. You do have to send us a clip, man, so I could be in it. Uh, no. no, he doesn't want to give away that joke, dude. Yeah. What are you doing, I need man? That. See, the, he's trying to make all, you awkward right now. Yeah, yeah. All the he's working that magic. people that. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Dude, what are you <laughs> talking about? Dude. Every episode, we have to be prepared to blow up, dude. Yeah, that's true. That's the responsibility oh, that. that comes yeah. mm-hmm. with posting these videos. The next day, dude, you might be getting canceled. Which one of you is the wise one? Out of Neither, the two? dude. No, I don't think we are. Probably Brandon. I agree with yeah. that. Yeah. And it, <laughs> well, you, you fall for the simple tricks. Yeah. <laughs> the candy trick, dude. I don't He's know how the, the fuck you fell for that guy. one. <laughs> yeah, no, I can see that. I don't know how we just all flow. 
I don't even know how, like, how this all came about was just crazy. There's a good flow. We look like we're from three different continents. (laughs) (laughs) You know? (laughs) India. Oh, that's not a continent. Asia. (laughs) Asia, yeah. Asia, (laughs) the Indian continent. (laughs) Damn, dude. Well, there's a When we were talking about you being slow earlier. (laughs) Yeah, you're right. Hey, I'm gonna <laughs> drop a random fact on y'all. Do you know? Do you know the the country with the second largest black population in the world <laughs> is Brazil? Is that really? what's it, is America up there? In any of them? I think it's gotta be. It's gotta, gotta be it's, third. I think or it's fourth. Nigeria or Kenya is first. I don't know. Oh well, and then it's Brazil. Yeah, if you're taking, I'm taking just all the African countries should be. One through whatever. But even with the African, but countries, Brazil is Brazil's so big. Still number two. They have like 75 million like black people. Damn. African descent. Mm-hmm. That's interesting. Yeah, they Why are you looking black. that up, Chief? <laughs> I'm in <laughs> modern you, Latin American after? history. Yeah. Shout out Dr. Pacino, dude. She came to one of my shows. <laughs> hey, shout out. Well, I forgot you're in school. Yeah, dude. That's an easy excuse How for could that. you forget? I'm so scholarly, bro. <laughs> Academia is my realm. Comedy is just a hobby, dude. <laughs> I'm a scholar at heart. Nothing wrong with being a scholar, gentleman, and a scholar. Dude, fucking guy. always. I know, I know a few things. I know what country has the second largest black population. Yeah, it's, in the I, world. It's, I feel like you got told a lot of stuff and that stuck. <laughs> yeah. Oh, <dude. laughs> I don't retain this one. When I hear stuff about that, I'm like, okay, dude, I'm remembering. Also, when I found <laughs> out UAH used to be a plantation, yeah, that's I'll wild. never forget that one, dude. Yeah, I don't I fuck that with joke. that. UAH sucks. <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> What are our alumni shirts going to be, you know, like our historical shirt? You know, like how Auburn and the big SEC schools have the fucking, like, all the maps and shit? What mm-hmm. would ours be, dude? We couldn't even make one. We get canceled just for fucking making it. I have no clue. I swear I, swear I go to the school, but I have no clue about I'll just focus on, like, the science. It's not, <laughs> not like the slavery past. <laughs> <laughs> I think they could do something. <laughs> how can they not mention it? That's what I'm saying. It's so <laughs> integral to the history of the university, dude. I think they'll be fine. <laughs> Talk about other stuff. <laughs> they do all kinds of stuff. Oh, yeah, we go. Are y'all like a tight schedule today? Oh, yeah, you got a show. I got it, but I'm good. I got Big I got boy dumb got the show. Got the you're so show. good at comedy. <laughs> gang, gang yeah. over here. How it is, many, are, and it's for like big, strong heroes and stuff. Why are you struggling with I thought the it was the tree. That? That's weird. I didn't <laughs> think strong. I you was, got a camera right wow, on That's you. crazy. I did he that. was like in big I really was just that's playing with That's a clip the right there. <laughs> that sucks. The, the Mike Tamer. The military man. <laughs> <laughs> At least he did it too. I feel better yeah, now. Yeah, Thank you. With, You're here with you. Come on, man. I don't know how I would approach it. I've never put it. Now that I have to think about it, uh-huh. it just kind of came naturally Do you think you would just grab it? Or do you think you would... What's the action? What are we sucking dick? What are we jerking off? He, he looked like he was more jerking off the military. Guys. I was just playing with it. <laughs> I was just playing with it? I don't know. What do you mean? I was Maybe same. dap it up. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I just met the guy. Come on. <laughs> you guys dude? are so forward, bro. Toxic masculinity. <laughs> yeah, guys, I've recorded you guys are 20 assholes. more minutes. <laughs> Let me jerk off real quick. <laughs> Let me jerk something off. Yeah, let's record. <laughs> Actually, can we do a lot more time? Yeah, can we? Re- I'm having fun. Let's start yeah, sharing, dude. This is actually pretty cool. <laughs> you want the pen? Where's the pen at? We just get you know, the you, you <laughs> I use yours? No, I, I got it right here. I was like, oh. you can use mine. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Let's see how bad. Jesus Christ. <laughs> we don't give a fuck over here. <laughs> I thought you were a superhero. I actually flinched, dude. I was so scared. I was like, it's going to fly at me at superhuman speed. That's the strongest comic in Huntsville. Oh, shit. It might put a hole right through me. <laughs> You do look like the before of uh, Captain America. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm going for when I'm, when <laughs> I'm making these jokes. Captain America, if instead he had the super soldier serum, he just like started working out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he just took a diet. He didn't even work out. He just kind of got a diet plan. <laughs> he, he just started to, eating. He they got out sometimes. of the Great Depression. He could afford food again. <laughs> <laughs> he just got some money. <laughs> well, fuck you, dude. You don't look great. <laughs> You ever think about how you look? Dude, you're like... <laughs> it's you're not like, awesome. <laughs> what it, dude, I can blank it on the word, dude. Mm-hmm. It's not upper class. It's not lower class. <laughs> middle class? Middle class. I was going to say medium class. I don't, I don't take drugs, dude. Oh, yeah, um, <laughs> do you need to? Me, dude, Get you're your like fucking up. middle class Steve Rogers, dude. <laughs> he just got to go to fucking Aldi. 
I'm not sure Steve Rogers. Oh, is that uh, Captain America? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, dude, this cool is I comics. told you I'm a scholar, dude. It's intellectual. <laughs> <comics>. Marvel <laughs> comic book scholar. It's World War Two, dude. It's history. The Red Skull tried to fucking kill the Jews. <laughs> or whatever, dude. Yeah, who's <laughs> I'm not saying it's right. <laughs> I'm just saying it happened. Dude, you gotta come more confident than that. <laughs> Killed the Jews or something. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe if you guys want to. <laughs> Whatever, dude. I don't have four years of experience in all these shows under my belt Hell like yeah. you do, dude. You're just my inspiration. I get nervous. Yeah, you got all this there. internet talking. You got all that stuff. That's pretty cool. Does it? It has done nothing for my career. It people has come to help up, with your confidence. You're putting yourself out there like that. The only mm-hmm. reason people confidence. will come up to me is if they s- have seen the Grimace video where I get sexually assaulted by the McDonald's mascot. Yeah, that's That's huge. not what you want to be known for, though. <laughs> like, well, you, now that that's the thing that's out there, what can you be nervous about? Yeah. No. You see, that's out there to everybody to see. That shit's embarrassing. Damn, dude. I am a man of, of I'm scholarship, and that is pretty good logic. I'm trying to find a way around it. I try to risk <laughs> That's just fucking embarrassing what you did. <laughs> Whatever, dude. It was cool for like three seconds. <laughs> no, it was fun. I'm just kidding. What's your favorite type of genre of movies? What do you, like? <laughs> huh? you always just bring up what the questions you? with no, like, you don't. That, you skip the four your play paper? to the question. <laughs> did, you, did you fucking. It like does get not on say my what Facebook, is your favorite in my Instagram type of and be like, I wonder what kind of movies he likes. Yeah. <laughs> Let's read, dude. <laughs> this is like a guy who doesn't know what kind of movies. Uh, I would say comedy, but comedy movies kind of suck balls, unfortunately. Yeah. I would like it to be comedy, but they just don't ever put out good ones. Not Nowadays, anymore. that's yeah. for damn sure. Uh, so I'm going to say action. Right. I love anime, so that's really Are what you I serious? fuck with. Yeah. You like anime? It's, a, it's anime. all I watch, really. Sports and anime. Basketball and anime. Well, That's it. You, you can watch both of those things in the same show. I hate that show. I don't I watch, watch that. Basketball anime. Yeah, they do have that, but I don't fuck with that. Do you think eventually they will start animating the basketball games in real time and do like an NBA anime game? They could. They probably got a filter for that already. They do have like yeah. the Slime. cartoon, like Anthony Davis. and They have like a whole NBA produced show and shit. The NFL Nickelodeon game where, like, slime comes on the field. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whatever, dude. That it, that, but that's uh, that's good for, like, kids. This guy's over here saying he listens to anime, watches anime. Yeah, No, dude, it's, like, never, it's not for kids. He, I used to be into it. I don't watch it's it. It's not for kids. Anymore. It's not. No. So no, what's, what's your uh, anime of choice? Or right now, Jujutsu Kaisen, bro. That's, that's, the that's everybody's one, one though. It is? Yeah, I it's so good. It. You, if you watch it, you would like it. It's called what now? Jujutsu Kaisen. Okay. I'm going to look it up now. I'm You're going to forget it. You're no, going to be able to Juju Kaisen. I already <laughs> fucked it up. <laughs> Juju Slide. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. The Juby Slide. <laughs> yeah, the Juby Slide. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got it. <laughs> Anime is just dancing, dude. That's all it is. That's In a way, martial like arts. Shakira, huh? hmm? That's why you move your hips like Shakira. Go and stroke that mic for me real quick. <laughs> Go and stroke that mic. <laughs> Say it again. That's why you move your hips like Shakira. I love the way you move your hips. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this guy. This guy does talk shit. Dude. This motherfucker. I told right you, here, dude. Man. I tried to sneak warn you. Dish. All I can do is sit oh, over here and just dish. watch some peril. <laughs> That wasn't a sneak this though. I know. That was just a very overt, mean <laughs> thing to say. <laughs> it wasn't mean. Guys, but we're having feelings. fun. Dude, dude, I know, dude. Yeah. Let me get this cake again. Yeah, go get that. It's good. I know you get wet, little nigga. Yeah, <laughs> Playboy. Hey, Playboy. Hey, Playboy. He can hey. say the N word, which makes him infinitely cooler. <laughs> That's a plus. That's cool. Yeah, dude. You just can't match that in a roast. You know what I'm saying? No, you can you never can. pull that card out of your back pocket. Because that's the, that's the ejector seat, bro. You got to have the car If running. a black guy calls you the N-word? No, if it was the other way around. I'm saying oh, you yeah. can what never do, do that, dude. He's talking about if, if you was like this nigga right here. Yeah, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, saying, I'm not advocating that you should. I'm just saying uh-huh. he has that ability, and it is funny. As a white it person, anytime you hear somebody say the N-word, you're like, Hey, Jake loves it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Jake loves it. He gets such a kick. I'm like, I'm like, he, he'll Jake. be like, can I do something? I'm like, hell yeah, nigga, go here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He gets all giddy he about it. Okay. Yeah, dude, we get excited. It turns us off. Turn us up, bro. I, I, I turns us on. Up. I said up. Oh. No more of this. Oh shit. So I did write down one more thing. I Ask to me talk away, about, bro. Dude. What's up? 
you know, one time I was over at another comedian's apartment. Sci-fi. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I've heard of him. Yeah. I know y'all are acquaintances. Mm-hmm. He told me when I entered the building that you were, the facility, that you were smoking gay weed. Oh, you mean like legal weed is mm. what it is. But is that it's what you THCA. mean by gay? That's what yeah. he means. I don't say that. I I heard it was <laughs> gay. I heard that you claimed it was gay weed. You did? Sci-Fi told me that you came in and was like, <laughs> you, like yeah, we can smoke some you? of this gay weed. <laughs> that's what Bryce calls it. <laughs> BT dubs. No, that's what he, he said. That's, he was impersonating you. He's like, hey, we can smoke some of this gay weed. He said that you did this. Is this false? Yeah, it's false. When you ask me like that, dude, everything's <laughs> false. If you put your hand out like that at me, yes, sir, officer. I'm giving you the Chris false. Hansen body language. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'd I'd like do to have a seat. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> nah, dude. But what's up with the gay weed, man? I smoke it. I smoke like uh, the legal weed all the time. So it's just like what you can buy at the store. Yeah, it's just at the shop, Canna Bar and Mercantile. Yeah, come on down. It's some good stuff. Get you high. <laughs> I smoke it every night. I'm doing great. <laughs> don't you want to be like me? Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> stare at it. You want to be the strongest person that smokes the cigarettes? The strongest. <laughs> you guys are going to be beat up. And you're and you, and you banging a lot of black bitches, huh? <laughs> I've also heard this theory. Yeah. So if I tell you that? Yeah. And Bryce so, was like, I'm making a lot of black multiple bitches. people. It was like Bryce be tearing them black chicks up. Yeah. yeah. Light skin with big booties. Okay. <laughs> I accept. <laughs> right. All right. Oh. I thought he had a picture of evidence. I, think, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I have somebody Actually, that you can speak to. Yeah. I can give you a reference. Yeah. <laughs> Brandon would say some shit like that. Dude. No, I'm all about uh, all that stuff, but hmm? no, nah, I haven't really explored that realm that much, really. Oh, okay. Really? We got to no. get on Tinder oh, and dude. set it to black. I have such a good story for this. What? But I'm scared that it's not going to get in the episode because it's like we're running out of time, dude. Uh, I'll say it just for shits and giggles, dude. Cause this shit you don't want to waste it on me. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck is that, bro? Fuck, fuck Bryce. Just dude. say the good story. I want to hear it. Oh, my bad, dude. I don't know if I want to tell this really good story. Like, it's really good. Well, I want it. It's... Damn, Damn, you a big handy guy? <laughs> <laughs> I love them. You'd like them, too? <laughs> I mean, they're all right. Ah, just, what are, you, are you into them? Fuck no. Okay. Don't try to give me a hand job. I can jack myself off. Now, head. I mean, to start it off, and you and like you just kind of like imagine if your two are like sitting. I don't want to. But I'm talking about hard, hand but. job until completion. <laughs> no, no, no. no. <laughs> I don't want you to ever say those words again. <laughs> I don't want you to ever say those out that loud. Sounds like a charge. <laughs> hand job to completion. Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> you know, high treason. Hand job to completion. That should be illegal, dude. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> That nobody was operating under that assumption. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Uh, no, I'm not a big fan of that. <laughs> All right, this then the podcast. Now, Bryce, if you want to say anything to that camera, anything you got coming up, you're at, all that good stuff. Yeah, follow me at B.A. Flett on Instagram, Bryce Fletcher on Facebook. Yeah, put all my upcoming dates and whatnot up there. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right. All That's right. It. That's it.